organization that is trying to help the community, basically is what we do. As Rotary Interact, it's our mission to support and help both our school, community, and then internationally as well. So every year we pick an international organization, which this year is Save the Children, and we fundraise, we create community events, all sorts of different things to raise money to donate for that. Very good. Now, Anna, do you guys have like a board? Do you have it organized as far as you have the president and the secretary, treasurer? I mean, do you have the whole board and everything involved? And what is your position with the organization? Um, we do actually have a whole board set up. Um, I am the vice president this year, and next year I will take over as the president. Um, and basically, we all have our individual roles. The presidents usually lead the meetings, and the vice president helps out. Um, the secretary takes the notes so that we can look over what we've done and what we hope to do, and the treasurer keeps track of all of our money. Very good. And Chelsea, what would you say is the, the most rewarding thing about being part of this organization has been since you've been a part of it? Well, I've been a member of the Interact Club since I was a freshman. So I think the most rewarding is just watching the group come together throughout the years. We've had to deal with a lot of advisor changes. We've actually never had the same advisor for, I mean, I've had a different advisor every year so far of high school. And the most rewarding would be seeing us come together and then make a change in the community. community. I think we have done a great job at advertising for events, creating new events, and just getting our name out there in general. Very good. And Hannah, what do you look forward to next year is when you take over as being the president? Is there any uh, activities or anything you might be planning or thinking in, in the future as far as adding to what already the great program that the Rotary Interact is already? Um, I'm really excited to uh, come up with some new events that we can do. Um, I haven't really thought of anything in particular quite yet, um, but keeping some of the old ones and doing them just as well, if not better. And how often do you guys meet at school? We actually meet every Wednesday night at the Y from 5.30, 5.45 to about 6.30. Okay. And it's pretty structured or is it a little bit more, you know, not as formal and just it's more input from everybody trying to, to work on a certain project like you have the fundraiser coming up next Friday? Yeah, I think it really depends on the week. <laughs> sometimes we're all really excited and it's a little more informal and sometimes it's a little more structured. It's We try and make sure everybody has the opportunity to speak and Everybody can get their ideas because we're open to all of the students. Sure. Yeah, we definitely have a lot of fun doing it, too. <laughs> Always looking for new members, I imagine. Can people join at any time, or does it have to be at the start of the school year? Absolutely. We prefer that you start at the school year, at the beginning of the school year, just so you get more acquainted. But if there are students out there who are interested in helping the community and the world, can always use volunteers at our events and new, fresh ideas. We're happy to invite anybody else. Great. Well, thank you very much. Thank you.